Well, hey there, hi there, and ho there, everybody. Welcome back to Challenge Farm. We missed Penny's birthday. Feel a little bit bad about it, but... We were busy planting our crops, and here we are now. Three and four in fall. Somewhat perturbed spirits today. Weather report is cloudy. Queen of sauces, hazelnuts, which we knew how to make. Yeah, so here we are. Now, we've got a couple tasks before us. I would like to get more crystallariums, but to do that... We just literally need more stones. Which is kind of a funny thing to have to need, really, but... I mean, that's where we're at. We still have this huge swath of corn. That, honestly, I don't know what we're doing with it. No, we don't need it. I think I might just start selling it this whole season. We have several hundred of them stored up in our shed. And it just seems to me that uh, that would be the best way to go. We planted a lot of mixed seeds, and we planted a lot of... Uh, other crops that we had seeds for, so now it's just a matter of seeing what the heck happens with what we planted and what they all are. Which I think will be pretty entertaining. Toss all those in there. Grab our good friends down here so we have some fish stored up, and let's see, what do we have? Yes, yes, no. Darn. Well, the crab pot has started giving us... The crab pot. The uh, the crab fish pond has started giving us items again, which is great. But sadly... Um... Just, uh... Still not what we need, which is the Nautilus ship. Now, granted, it is only a 2% chance, so it's not like... You know, it's not like we're likely to see it, is what I'm trying to say. It's not very likely. But it is a possibility, so we'll keep trying. After I get done recording this lovely episode for all of you, I get to go to my least favorite place in the world. That's right, I have to go shopping for dog food. Which is a, a necessity, but not necessarily a joy. How are we one off? Oh, because of the dino egg. Yeah, I guess that would make sense. Well, I think we'll hold on to this egg. And we'll put it in the fridge. Nope, nothing. Darn. Bats, please. Work with me. You were doing so well for like three days there. We got stuff from you and it wasn't what we wanted, but uh, I mean, at least it was something. And then now we're back to nothing again. Very sporadic, the bats. They're, they're uh, you know, they only work when they want to, which is apparently not very often. Get rid of that grass. Don't need no grass over here. So I'm thinking once we hit winter. We're going to move our sheds over here. Either that or we're, we'll, we'll do something over here so we can, I don't know, do something with this. I mean, right now, it's just kind of there. We have to keep expanding our farm empire is what I'm trying to say. See what goes up here. Do I not have mahogany? Oh, I do have mahogany seeds. Wait, do I not have mahogany seeds? No, I did. I did. Let's put those away. Okay, so what else do we want? Let's grab some melons, maybe? Can make some melon seeds. That seems smart. And some red cabbage. Make those seeds. Uh, where did we put... There they are. Wait, where did we put all of our ancient seeds? But I found them. Okay. Honey, let's do this. The mead should be ready. Not much else we can do with our honey, so we'll just uh, we'll just make more mead, I guess. No, oh, that'll be good for Willy. Willy likes it. Willy loves mead. It's 72 mead in there. I don't, you know, I'm pretty sure that that is gonna be a sufficient quantity, even for our good friend Willy. 
That'd be a whole lot of gifts. Uh, well, since I'm in here, by the way, let's just grab one of those. Let me go run over and see the wizard. Drop this off. Yes, we are. All right. Put this here. Put that there. Put all those in there. Wait for like five minutes. <laughs> Grab them all out of there. There we go. And we only got two. Really? We only got two back. Ah, uh, they each gave me only one. Okay. Well, it is what it is. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's get the melon seeds. Boom, boom, ch boom, ba -dum, ch boom, boom, ch boom. Hey, speaking of fun things, uh, I, did I mention this? I just got a new web camera. Um, and it was expensive. <laughs> We're not going to talk about how much it cost me, but we are going to talk about how awesome it looks because it looks pretty good. And uh, that was the problem with my other web camera. Is that, uh, I mean, I had one. I have a bunch of scenes for it for the live stream all ready to go and set up and everything. But I just really hated how it looked. Uh, it wasn't a clear picture at all. And it drove me crazy. Uh, so anyway, so I, I started, I did a bunch of research this last week. On, like, good looking web cameras. <laughs> and, um... Anyway, as a result of that, I have procured for myself a new web camera. It is the uh, the InstaLink, uh, the the Insta360 Link is what it is, and uh, it's it's pretty nice, pretty nice. Let's grab those, grab this, grab this, grab one of those, grab one of these. Uh, where do we got a duck feather? Okay, we got grapes. No, grab a grape. Grab a strawberry. Yeah, okay. A couple of that. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, no, 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 we have a grape. Uh, what else do we need? A couple peppers. Um. Yeah, let's go with that. Now. We didn't get around to it in this episode. However, in the next episode, I will... Next week's episodes, I guess I should clarify. Uh, I'm going to do my best to get the horse. Um, try and get the horse going. I think it would assist us on days like today where I just want to run around and visit people. The animals are literally in the way, slowing me down. Excuse me, please. So yeah, so we will we will focus on that, but not today. Well, maybe maybe Thursday in game. Maybe maybe the second day of this episode we'll we'll do it. I'm just still not sure if I have enough resources. The stable takes hardwood, right? I think so. Oh, Chantrell, hello. How are you today? Oh, Winston. He hears a siren. He's howling along to it right now. He's going, Arr! Arr! It's adorable. I actually have a recording of him doing that on my phone, but sadly I I couldn't see him. I could only hear him as he was doing it. Which is a little bit of a shame. A little bit of a shame. But, cause, I mean, but it's just so stinking adorable. He just throws his little head back. Ow! Pretty funny. And it's a certain siren, too. Like it's a ambulance or something. All right, wizard. What are, what are we at? Three? Oh, jeez. All right, let's try to remember to bring the wizard a gift, like, every day, okay? Can we, can we try to remember to do that? All right, great. <laughs> well, at least we have room for this blackberry now. Time to grab this horseradish. Another mushroom. No, don't. 
Just get the mushroom, please. Mushroom, blackberry. Hazelnut. Hazelnut is the last one. I was like, what is the last one? It's a hazelnut. Uh, I, yeah. Yeah, we never did successfully fish up that, <laughs> that darn that darn thing in here either, did we? The slime jack and the uh the mutant carp or whatever it is. Oh Harvey! Harvey! I was prepared. I had an item for you. I just didn't, you know think you would actually be out of your clinic. No one's home at all? Well, that's interesting. I don't think I have anything for Haley. Kent, I don't really... I got an espresso. Do you want an espresso? Okay. I don't have your favorite item, Kent. I haven't found any hazelnuts yet. Evelyn, sorry. I don't have much for you either. Feels bad. That being said... George, I do have a leak. There you go, George. Uh, if we can find Maru, I've got some stuff. Obviously, she's not in there. Closed on Wednesday. Darn not having a key from the island to be able to just get in everywhere I want to when I want to. Where's Caroline? Um, hmm. Well, I don't really feel like I have anything that you like, honestly. Sorry. I should probably grow some tea saplings in the greenhouse so that we have something to give to her. <laughs> Yes, I should. All right, let's start in the back. And then this is also yours. And then this is for you. Who was walking? There's Lewis. Lewis, I have a pepper. There you go. Alex, I, I, I don't. I don't know what to get to Alex either. Oh, probably a cherry would work, I say, as I hold it and run away from him. Good job, Hope Home. Elliot's not home. Elliot! Where are you, Elliot? I... I ask you. Hey, okay, mixed seeds. Not bad. Uh, Willie, are you over here? How much room do I have? Not very much. I ain't got hardly no rooms at all. Well, let's toss a couple things I don't need. We can at least pick up some stuff. Uh, probably won't do all the, f the crab pots because I just don't have the room. There you go. All right, where are we at? Eight out of 10. That's lovely. I have two, two spots <laughs> open. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna work out. Oh, we did find Penny. That's nice. Oh, there's Elliot. Where, where did I... Where's your duck feather? Elliot? Elliot, where's your duck feather? Elliot? There it is. <laughs> uh, I was looking for a pomegranate in my head for a second. Eggplants are in high demand. Okay. Well, that should be super simple to do because we planted a ton of eggplant. I love this. You're the best. No problem, Abigail. I appreciate that you are at eight hearts with me. Now, where's that cherry? Can I get in here? Oh, it's a George event. No, I can't reach it. If only I could get up from this infernal chair. Excuse me, Mr. George, sir. Do you need some assistance? Thanks, young man. And no problem. It happened 30 years ago. I was working in the coal mines. We were near the end of our shift, but there was one last seam that needed to be broken up. I went in there aiming to set off a stick of dynamite, but my foot slipped into a crack and I dropped it. The dynamite exploded on impact. The next thing I remember, I was laying in the hospital and they told me I'd never walk again. 
So there you have it. You probably figured I was just too old to walk. Well, I'll have you know I'd be sprier than a spring chicken if I hadn't been in that accident. Hmm. You've been very nice to me, young man. I appreciate that. When you're old, you start to forget that anyone cares about you. Poor George. Oh, double event. Okay. Oh, Max, you're wondering what that good smell is? Well, that's the s that's nice of you to say. I'm, I'm baking cookies. Hey, cookies are delicious. Hey, why don't you try one? Okie doke. Don't mind if I do. I do like a good cookie. Well, what do you think? Uh, I think they were delicious. Thank you. I think I come to know you well enough to give you my recipe. Just keep it secret. We learned how to make cookies. Okay. Cookies are tasty. Now, where's that cherry? Here we go. That's cool. All right. Well, I don't know what cool means. My grandpa loves leek. It would make a great gift. All right. Two out of eight. Okay. Alex is my grandson. Have I told you that already? Huh? Speak up. All right. Six out of eight. Not bad. What about over here? The mayor put me in charge of the, the gardens. Okay. The fall flowers are delicate. Don't step on them. <laughs> oh, God. I won't step on them, Evelyn. I promise. Right, Shane, I have a pepper, which I know that you like. Marnie, we're gonna I'm gonna give you the cherry, I guess. Where are we at? Two? Man. Pam? Seven? Uh Gus? I don't I don't know, man. Do you want a mushroom? That's sweet, thank you. Six out of ten. Let's just talk to you. I think we might already be. Yeah, eight out of eight. Okay. My friend runs a shop in the desert. If you ever go there, stop and say hi. Yeah, I, I will do that. So Emily is maxed. Penny we gave a gift to. Looking for a seaweed. George, I'm not I'm not getting you a seaweed, George. Well, let's go run over here. And go up here and just see if we can find somebody outside. It's it's doubtful. And yes, I was correct to doubt. Okay. Uh, there was an artifact spot though right here. Lovely. The door is locked. 8 o'clock. Okay. These things happen. I understand. It's not personal. Well, there's a plum that is still not hazelnuts. <laughs> oh, goodness. Do we need sea urchins for anything? I don't... I mean, probably not. I can't imagine what we would need them for. 137. Okay, so we do probably have enough then. Right? I hope. Bunch of things can go in there. Even though they're technically gifts, but whatever. It's fine. Um, well, we can put them in here, I guess. We can put that there. No harm not to, really. Stack up there. All right, and we have these. Did you not stack because you're too good? You're too good of a quality? I see. I see. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> you know, actually, let's keep all these in the inventory because those are all gifts for people who are over at Robin's house. So... Just bring all those with us. Now, let me look up over here on the wiki real fast. The stable. Stable Stardew. What do I need to build you? 100 hardwood, 5 iron. Okay. See, I knew 100 stuck in my head for a reason. And 5 iron. Alright, I think we have that too. 5 iron. 
and 100, 100 hardwood. Oops. Oh, can I? Oh, half the stack? Okay, that'll work. Perfect. 105. Excellent. So we're all ready to go for that. Yeah, we're going to go to bed actually a little early in the game today so that we can just get right on that in the morning. Go to sleep, yes. Perfect, lovely, amazing. And honestly, that 20000 will pretty much pay for the <laughs> stable. Excellent, yes, excellent. Mm, yes. Now, the only thing that we have to be concerned with is that outside... We might need to do a couple of things. Let's grab some more of this. And we'll grab some more of these. There we go. Now we know it was no one's birthday today, so we don't have to double check the calendar. But we do, we will check the TV. Lightning and, th oh, okay, we got a storm coming. Spirits are annoyed, okay. So farmers report strange happenings. Indeed. You know, the other thing I was going to look up is uh, the Desert Trader in Stardew. Because when when can we get Magic Rock Candy? On Thursdays. Perfect! And today is a Thursday. Ah, look at that. My brain is supplying me with information I've not needed previously. But today it's actually working. Oh my goodness. A day where Hillhelm's brain is working? Say what? Get out of town. Now, where are those? Beautiful. Uh, I think staircases are only on Sundays, though. You know, do we just... Do we have some Omni Geodes? Oh, yeah. Nice. How much Iridium Ore do we have? Quite a bit. Now nah, we better save those for bars in case we need it. Okay. Boop, boop. Go into the desert. Look at all these trees. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. Now then. I need this. Oh, that's beautiful. And then I would like, you know, just some more of these in general. Excellent. Well, I mean, since we're here, you know, we might as well. Do I not have my... I don't have the pan with me? What am I doing with my life? I mean, seriously. A pan for maybe that, that could be the lucky ring right there. Like, you know, we just, you know, we, we don't know. It could also be nothing. You don't know until you try. Okay. Got all that. Where's my copper pan? It's like artifact day today. Look at this. We got a mountain totem. That's always fun. Ugh. I saw fruit and I got excited internally for a second. And then once again, my soul was crushed by the bats. Every day. Every day the bats just suck out a little bit more of my joy of life. It's not really that bad. <laughs> Sometimes you have to exaggerate for effect, you know what I'm saying? But I can never keep it straight long enough to, like, make you think I'm serious. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's too good. That's... <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. Alright, we're going to bring one of these again, because we're going to go back to the desert in just a second. Like, why are you going back to the desert? Listen, you. 
I want to see <laughs> if what was that that gold spot still there? Where is my pan? Have I not gotten it? Surely we have it by now. What the heck? Why is it not here with the other tools I'm not using? Okay, we have to search every chest now. Re come mm. Really? <laughs> really? <sighs> All right. <laughs> Let's look around. There it is. Good gracious. Good gracious. All right. Back to the desert. I doubt it's still there, but, you know, maybe. Maybe. You never know. Please still be there. Excellent. Lucky ring! Uh, well, we got six coal, so that's... I'm not going to complain about six coal. Uh, that was so exciting. Oh, a hazelnut! Yay! Lots of plums. Oh my goodness. So we've been to the desert twice today, and Pam is still not even over to the bus stop. That's pretty funny. Morning, Pam. How are you today? <laughs> Don't mind me. Just uh, teleporting around the place, you know? It's all good. It's all good. Okay, nobody's outside. Oh, there's another hazelnut. Yes. Good, 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 good. I think we need three to make a roasted hazelnut there. Oh, an event. I didn't tell you to get tomatoes. I said fruit. I don't understand. Tomatoes are fruit. When a normal person says they want fruit, they never mean tomatoes. It doesn't matter what the scientific classification is. Max, I'm glad you're here. You'll be able to put this argument to rest. Question mark. How would you classify a tomato? Okay, listen. We're going to say fruit because I always say vegetable. See, Max agrees with me just want you to understand my point of view. It's hard for me to know exactly what assumptions I should make when you tell me something. But I'll try to get better at it. Thanks for your help, Max. Well, actually, that seems to work out better than the other answer. That's funny. Okay, and have a peach. How we doing? Nine out of ten. That's what we like to see. Hey, Demetrius. I've got a lovely ice cream for you. 7 out of 10. Send me a Nautilus shell. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Seb's not... Oh, Seb is here. It's like Seb's not even here. What? Here you go, Seb. Have a frozen tear. It's not near beer, but that's okay. Uh, we're going to make a stable. Now, the only thing is, where do we put this stable? Like, I think it's going to look the most sense. It's going gonna, it's gonna to look best here, is what I'm saying. But I think I'm going to have to put it here, and then it's just going to look weird. Maybe, do we just put it over here? Do we just put the stable, like... I mean, I'm okay with that as a solution. Like, reorganize some of this top part or something? We can move all of it, all of the crops down by one for the next season. There we go. I'll start working on it in the morning. Thank you, Robin. I appreciate your hard work on my behalf. Now, where is Maru? Oh, Maru. Where have you gone? I have, I have a strawberry, Maru. Okay, and I would really like to give it to you. But I don't know where you are, which makes it harder to give it to you. Hello, Maru. Hello. Are you in here? Are you working today? Oh, look at that. You are. Maybe. Oh, I'm so sick of preparing samples. Ah! Crash. Oh, no. What took place? That's terrible. What an awful thing to have happen. I can't believe it. Oh, no. That's not good. 
Super genius. Super genius indeed. <laughs> the whole sample's ruined. Harvey's gonna kill me. Uh-oh. That's not good. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Now, what do I do? Uh, look, just tell him it was an accident. Just be up front. You're right. I should tell him. Hey, uh, we're gonna have to collect some more specimens. <laughs> what happened? I heard something break. I accidentally dropped one of the samples. I'm sorry. Thanks for telling the truth, Maru. Don't worry about it. We'll just get another one. Big smiles. Thanks for being patient with me, Dr. Harvey. Of course, you've been a big help around here. I don't know what I'd do without you. Question mark? Max, you look a little pale. Are you feeling okay? Oh. I feel fine, doctor. Thank you. It's an emergency? It is It is for you. An emergency to give you this glorious strawberry. I know it's not your favorite, but you can have an espresso. It's okay. Oh no, Gus! No, Gus! I'm, no, I'm trying. No! Let me oh, gee, I was trying to go back in the building. No, Gus! No, Gus! Why? <laughs> no, that's not what we wanted to do. <laughs> oh, Gus! You just should have let me in the building, dude. That's not cool. Oh man. Gus. Oh, jeez. Maybe we should title this episode Grossing Out Gus. That'd be a fun title. Oh my gosh, they did it! They really did it! Oh, happy day! We got a Nautilus shell. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> yes, at last! Oh, that's so good. Now we can fire all the crabs. <laughs> oh, jeez. Crabs, your mission was successful. Thank you so much for your participation. Empty the pond. Yep. Perfect. Well, that is just super exciting. Getting a horse, got a Nautilus shell. Oh my gosh. Apple count, still... Still zero. Let's just be brought back to Earth for a second there by the... The count of apples in our lives, which is uh, still a depressing total of nothing. Um, you know, it's, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We gotta put the hardwood away and start rebuilding our supplies there. Mm -hmm. And we need to put our hazelnuts there. You know, do we have fall forage seeds somewhere? Because, like, I should really make some of those. Where in the heck did I put them? I know that they're all in the same chest somewhere. There they are. Uh, summer, spring, fall. Okay. So we can do that. The rock candy in here. And preparation for the joy that will be ours. Well, maybe we maybe we best put it in here so I see it and remember <laughs> to take it with us. Right. Right. Uh we gotta sell a couple things. And we did grab the thing for growing eggplant, which should be, like, zero problems at all. So it's 2 o'clock on a nice fall afternoon in Stardew Valley. Uh, 
there are some things that we could do. Apricot. Do I have an apricot? No. Oh, yes. We have to change our fish pond out. That's what I was doing. That, okay. Do we have a lava eel conveniently just hanging out in a chest? Look at this. I am so prepared sometimes, you guys. I know that sometimes I'm not, but like so, like every once in a while, it all just comes together in a... I don't want to say it. That's not the right word. <laughs> We're not going to use that word. Uh, let's, let's go with smorgasbord. In a smorgasbord of joy. There we go. One lava eel. To rule them all. We have a lot of eggplants. That is going to be a crazy amount of eggplant. <laughs> well, that ought to be entertaining. Oh, Abigail's over here. Hi, Abigail. How are you? We're going to go mining. What are we going to go mining for? Do we go mining for coal or gold? <sighs> I do need coal. Perpetually. And we can turn iron into gold, technically. And we just need stones. So, I guess... I guess we can't even complain, like, if we have to break a bunch of rocks, right? Let's look for the big rocks, break the big rocks, see what else we need here. More iron, beautiful. What do you need to make monster musk, by the way? Like, do I have those resources readily available? Oh, diamond. Hello there, diamond. How are you today? Aha! There are some of you. Frozen geodes, very nice. I don't think opening geodes is really the path of our future, but... You know, we'll store them up, it's okay. We'll grab this big giant one. It's like ten... Wow! Wow, 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 wow. Instantly was attacked, viciously. Viciously slain by these flying skulls. Did you guys see that? I, I stabbed that sucker. That's amazing. Hey, what you gonna do about it? Nothing. You ain't gonna do nothing. You ain't gonna do nothing because you are nothing. You're just a, a flying skull. That's all you are. Actually, the flying skulls have really cool drops. Uh, if you ever are curious about what all they can drop, because it's 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 a ridiculous variety, and some of it's seasonal. If I remember correctly, you should really go look at it on the wiki sometime. Uh, it's it's pretty interesting. You can get some really nice stuff from them, depending on what you need. Ooh, all right, a monster floor. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Floor sixty-four. Okay. So we just want to, like, what, come back to floor 64 over and over again today? To try to find... Wow, that was a lag spike. Whoa, whoa, Vanilla Stardew, what are you doing? Never have I ever seen Vanilla Stardew lag like that. Wow. I wonder what caused that. Maybe I need to restart my computer. It's probably been, like, five days at least. Maybe seven. Uh, what I'm trying to say is I don't really restart my computer very often, unless I absolutely have to. Usually the reason my computer ends up restarting is because there's a Windows update, or a program that I'm using all the time finally freezes and it's like, help, we can't function. <laughs> and then, then I reboot. Uh, speaking of rebooting, I should probably, I think there's a new graphics driver that's ready to go. Let's probably install that too. You know, I used to be up on the graphics drivers like ever, like as soon as they came out, and I'm like, now I'm anymore. I'm just like, eh, everything's running mostly fine. I don't think I need to worry about it. Did I buy like the newest title that it's for? No. Okay. Uh, not gonna, not gonna be concerned about it then. Uh, by the way, I'm, I'm gonna plug this a lot, and you'll probably get tired of me hearing it, uh, hearing about it at some point, me mentioning it, but. I am trying to do a 100 days uh, Let's Play 
video for Minecraft, which means, of course, in order to do that, I have to have survived and recorded 100 days. Um, and so I'm working on that. Those videos are available to channel members. So if that is something you want to see, the full unedited video content of that, uh, you know, any any level of support channel member wise gets access to those videos. So if that's something you're interested in uh, and you're able to support in that way, you know, hey, come check it out. And if you enjoy it and, you know, stick around, you know, it's there for you to check out. In the same way, you know, if you uh, enjoy the content on the channel and have been having a great time hanging out with me, your host, Ilham, and you have not yet subscribed, you know what to do. Click that button and enjoy, enjoy all of the updates that come your way whenever I post content, which is uh, at least three days a week, sometimes four. I've, I've really been debating, by the way, what to do with the JoJo series. I think I know. I think I know finally. I'm going to try to get that recorded uh, this week. Yet. And um, we'll sort of... It's not going to be a goodbye to the series, I don't think. It's going to be more of a... Let's pause this until more content for the mods all comes out. And then when there's another big update to the mods, we'll jump back in and check out check out the new content. I think that's what I'm going to do with it. I don't think we're going to... I'm not going to delete the save file or anything. Uh, I might back it up somewhere. So, I mean, that's maybe something that I'll do. But I don't think... We're not going to get rid of it. And I don't think that's going to be like the end episode or whatever. Like permanently. It's just going to be more of a... Let's take a break until there's a lot of cool stuff that, that has come out that we can, that we can look at all together again. I think that makes the most sense to do. Unless at some point the mod developers of those mods all do the same thing that uh, Concerned Ape is doing with 1.6, which is, hey, to really get a handle on everything and see it all in context and etc, etc, you should probably just start over. Make a new save file, which is what uh, Concerned Ape is recommending for 1.6 in case you hadn't gotten that news. Not that you have to, you don't have to, but to see everything in order and all the new events and et cetera, et cetera, uh, he has said it would make the most sense if if you did that. So, uh, and if you needed that information, now you have that information. I try to I try to stay up on these things via X slash Twitter or whatever the heck we're calling it these days. Um, I do miss some posts here and there and now and then. Uh, that's that's true. Right, let's just toss some things where they go. I guess we'll put artifact troves there, I suppose. I don't know what to do with this ring. Like, we don't need it. I'm just going to toss it out. We're going to sell that scroll, and then I think what we're going to do real fast... Let's see, where... Where are they? Let's let's get some of these. Can we get, like, four? Yeah, that'll work. It's going to make this area, like, a little busy, but, um, oh well. Put one there. We're going to put one over here. Get rid of this. Now, if I put one here, is that too much? Like that? No, it's, I mean, it's all right. Put one there too. Oh, you can put one behind the tree. Ooh, that's nice. Until I walk behind here and forget it's there, then it's not going to be nice. But yeah, I should probably move that because I'm going to forget it's there. <laughs> I'm just trying to think of some places we can put these that you know, just like to help us see a little bit more. You know, there we'll put that one there. Anyway, we can see a little better now. And it's uh, time to jump into the bed because it's 1.50 a.m. Look at that. Look how fast that time went at the end. It was like, meow. Did I not pick up any truffles? <laughs> I didn't sell any truffles or anything. Oh, I'm a bad farmer. Oh, goodness. Okay. Well, there we go. Lots of great stuff has happened, friends, in these episodes this week. Appreciate y'all hanging out with me. We are still trying to get that 
that those three apples, but otherwise everything is going great in this playthrough. I'm very excited for how it's gone. Really been enjoying it. We go keep throwing gifts at the wizard in the hopes that... I don't know. Do you have to finish the community center before you can get stuff like the magic ink? I really don't remember. <sighs> but that's... Well, regardless. We'll just keep throwing things at him. It'll be fine. Okay, everybody. Thanks so much, and uh, we'll see you next time.